Hello everyone welcome back to my YouTube channel. The deletion of the Zeros project in Iraq, often referred to as Red Denomination, is a monetary reform plan that involves removing three zeros from the Iraqi dinar, IQD. This process is typically considered when a country experiences significant inflation, and the currency becomes cumbersome to use in daily transactions due to the large number of zeros. The concept of red denomination is not unique to Iraq it has been implemented by various countries around the world to simplify transactions, improve the efficiency of the payment system, and potentially enhance the currency's image both domestically and internationally. However, it's important to note that red denomination by itself does not inherently increase the value of a currency. It is a cosmetic change that alters the face value of banknotes and coins without affecting the purchasing power or the international exchange rate. For the Iraqi dinar, the idea is to replace old banknotes with new ones, effectively making 1,000 old dinars equivalent to one new dinar. The Central Bank of Iraq, CBI has indicated that this move is part of a broader plan to develop monetary policies and improve the economic situation in the country 1. The project has been discussed for several years, with various opinions on its feasibility and timing. To truly raise the value of the Iraqi dinar, the country would need to address underlying economic factors. The exchange rate of a currency is determined by a multitude of factors including economic stability, inflation rates, foreign exchange reserves, balance of payments, and overall economic performance. Iraq's economy has been through significant challenges, including conflicts and reliance on oil revenues. However, the country also has substantial foreign exchange reserves, estimated at $110 to $112 billion, and other assets like gold too. Diversification of the economy is crucial for long-term stability and growth. Iraq has been working on developing sectors such as tourism, agriculture, and natural gas. These efforts, combined with the implementation of new electronic systems for financial transactions, taxes, and tariffs, are steps towards a more robust economy. A stronger economy can lead to an appreciation of the currency's value over time. The CBI's strategy includes improving the banking system, transitioning towards electronic payments, and possibly amending the central bank law to support these initiatives. 3. These measures, along with international standards and future plans to enhance banking institutions, could pave the way for a more favorable exchange rate for the dinar. While the deletion of the Zeros project is a significant step in monetary reform, it is not a direct method to increase the value of the Iraqi dinar. The value of the currency will depend on the broader economic reforms, stability, and growth that Iraq pursues. If successful, these reforms could indeed lead to a stronger Iraqi dinar, reflecting the country's economic potential and resilience. The project is a symbol of hope for a more stable and prosperous future for Iraq's economy and its currency.